See, the, the people who should be educating you are the people who are trying to keep you from seeing the images that you need to see. 75% of those having abortions. The people who should be educating you are the people who are trying to cover up the images of these children who are being murdered. So many children, so many children are being murdered in your own city. And I'm showing you what those children look like so that you wake up to the reality of what's going on. And these people who should be educating you are actually keeping you from getting educated out here. They're trying to keep you from getting educated. Go down Gonzaga. You been down Gonzaga? You know what Gonzaga is? Go over the it's now. time to wake up. These children need your voice. They need your help. So many babies are being mass murdered Caucasians. in this city. By Caucasians. 75% abortions are by Caucasians. People say black lives matter, but abortion is the number one killer of black lives. By Caucasians, 75% say that. When are people going to wake up and realize Speak the facts. It's white. that when they say black lives matter and ignore abortion, they're being hypocrites. The black lives do matter. It, they do matter, so it's time to abolish abortion. Abortion is the number one killer of black lives. Black people compose 13% of the U.S. population, but around 30% of the abortions are black people. They're being decimated by abortion. They're being decimated by abortion. So when, when you say black lives matter, You'd better believe Black Lives Matter, and you'd better not be a hypocrite. Because you are a hypocrite if you say that Black Lives Matter, but you do not fight abortion. It is time to wake up. So many people being slaughtered in the city, and nobody seems to care. These young, this young generation needs to be educated. These young people need to be educated out here. Are they teaching you about abortion here? Are they teaching you the, about the fact that you're living in a genocide where thousands of babies are getting murdered on a daily basis in your country? Probably not, right? They're probably not teaching you that abortion is murder here. They're probably not teaching you from the law of God. They're probably teaching you from a pagan, secular, humanistic worldview. That's what public schools do. They teach people from a pagan, Secular humanistic worldview. That's a religious worldview. Everybody has religion. Everybody has religion. A religion is just a belief system that you use to make sense of reality. It's time for you to turn to Jesus Christ and be reconciled to God. Because if you don't, hell awaits you. Hell is real. The punishment for sin is real. The wrath of God is real. And I must warn people and tell them that Jesus Christ came to be the Savior of those who put their faith in Him.